Travis, you have come here today before God to celebrate love. All religions speak of love, for it's the root of our existence and the foundation upon which you will build your lives from this day forward. Marriage is a sacred commitment. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other relationship can equal. It's a union that is promised for a lifetime. Marriage deepens and enriches every facet of life. Happiness is fuller, memories are fresher, and commitment is stronger. Married love understands and forgives the mistakes that life is unable to avoid. It encourages and nurtures a new life, new experiences, and new ways of expressing a love that is deeper than life. We are created in order to love one another. We see the destiny of this in the love of a married couple, which bears the imprint of God's divine love. Love is our origin. Love is our constant calling. Love is who we are. When two people pledge their love for each other in marriage, they create a spirit unique unto themselves, which binds them closer than any written or spoken words. Marriage is a promise, a potential made in the hearts between two people who love each other that takes a lifetime to fulfill. Today, you proclaim your love and commitment before God and so I'm going to, well, you already are holding it. Oh, sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. I just felt like we should. I felt weird standing there and not doing it. No, and that's perfect. That's perfect. Okay, so I'm going to ask you both a couple of questions. Give you a hint. The answer is I do. Okay. So, Travis, I'm going to start with you. Okay. Travis, do you take this woman whose hand you hold, choosing her alone to be your wedded wife? I do. Do you promise to live with her in the state of true matrimony? I do. Do you pledge to love, comfort, and honor her at all times and to be faithful to her? I do. Okay. Jamie, your turn. He did very okay. well. <laughs> okay. Jamie, do you take this man whose hands you hold, choosing him alone to be your wedded husband? I do. Do you promise to live with him in the state of true matrimony? I do. Do you pledge to love, comfort, and honor him at all times and to be faithful to him? I do. All right. <laughs> well, having stated your intentions, I'm going to now ask you both to repeat after me. Well, one at a time. Travis, we'll start with you again. Okay. In the name of God. In the name of God. I, Travis, take you, Jamie. I, Travis, take you, Jamie. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold <laughs> from this day forward. To have and to hold to this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and cherish. To love and cherish. For all the days of our lives. For all the days of our lives. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I got fake lashes. <laughs> yeah, you try, to, you try to get through it and see what happens. I know. Well, it's her turn uh, now. I got to go first. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Jamie, in the name of God. In the name of God. I, Jamie, take you, Travis. I, Jamie, take you, Travis. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and cherish. To love and cherish. For all the days of our lives. For all the days of our lives. All right. I did good. You did good. You did good. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we're going to... Get the rings ready. All right, these rings mark the beginning of an adventure filled with wonder and surprise, laughter, sorrow, challenges, celebration, but hopefully mostly joy. They symbolize your two lives now joined in one unbroken circle. So bless, O oh God, these rings that each gives, receives, and wears as a sign of the covenant between them and you. May they wear them always as a visible reminder of the vows that they have spoken today. So Travis, well, Jamie, you're going to extend your left hand, and Travis, says you place the ring on her finger, you're going to repeat after me. Okay. Receive this ring. Receive this ring. As a symbol of wedded love and faith. As a symbol of wedded love and faith. Beautiful. Thank you. And now, Travis, you're going to extend your left hand, and Jamie, repeat after me. Receive this ring. Receive this ring. As a symbol of wedded love and faith. As a symbol of wedded love and faith. Let's 
let's just say a final prayer. Okay. Oh God, our hearts are filled with, ha- with great happiness on Jamie and Travis's wedding day as they pledge their hearts and lives to one another. Grant that they may be ever true and loving. Temper their hearts with kindness and understanding. Help them to always remember to be each other's friend, partner, and one true love. Nurture them with strength, love, and compassion for times of challenge. And with the passage of time, may the home they have created truly be a place of love and harmony where your spirit is ever present. Bless this union, we pray, and walk beside Jamie and Travis throughout their lives together. Amen. 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 Well, (laughs) in so much as you two have stated your intention to live together in marriage, you've said your vows, you've exchanged your rings, it is my great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Yay! Thank you.